All right, we're outside here live, and I'm with Ray Campbell. You are the tour manager of this Dole, what is it, Peel the Love. That's right, Peel the Love, <laughs> all across the country. I'm the tour manager for Dole Bananas Peel the Love Tour 2014. We're going across the country, getting people banana smoothies, banana s'mores. It's delicious, it's awesome, and we're gonna be having a lot of fun all summer long. Okay, so I take it you're a banana lover. Obviously. And uh, what are we doing here? I mean, this, at first I thought, are those real bananas? But oh, you are grilling them up. That's correct. These bananas have not gone bad. They are delicious and ready to go. What we do is we throw a banana on the grill. It turns black on all sides. You touch it, it's soft like a water balloon. Chop it right down the side. It's a delicious ready-made dessert. What we do is we throw a little piece of chocolate right inside just like so mm. and it's going to melt into a gooey caramelized delicious treat and so this is healthy right because it's bananas that's right it's healthy and it's fun and that's what we're all about here on the peel the love tour all right when you're grilling bananas do they have to be totally ripe do you want them still kind of green i think you know a misconception is that bananas have to be perfectly yellow if you have a little bit of brown spots on it it's ready to go if you're doing a little barbecue you know you can really freak out the neighbors throw a banana on the grill all of a sudden it's like why are you throwing a banana on the grill because you're going to have a delicious treat in a few minutes what we do is now it's all melted and then what we do is we take over here We've got some graham crackers. It's like a banana s'more. That's correct. Ooh. Chocolate banana s'more. Oh Give my. it a second because it's going to be cooey. Wow. It's going to be hot. So you guys have all kinds of ideas of what to do with bananas. That's right. On the Peel the Love Tour, we're going to be at 26 banana loving cities. And what we're doing, you can find us on dole.com slash peel the love. And at every stop, we're gonna be doing these type of demonstrations and we're gonna be giving you recipe books to show how to make these at home. So not only are you gonna be able to make super cool banana schmoes, but you'll also be able to make the delicious treats that Chef Troy's making also. All right, so have you been peeling the love very long? Did this tour just start? We've been going since uh, May 5th and we're going through September 5th. So four months of awesome peeling the love action. In this area, are they big banana fans? Oh my gosh, people love bananas here. They go bananas for bananas. <laughs> Dole bananas, to be more wow. specific. How, how many bananas are you serving up on the tour? Oh my gosh, uh, hundreds, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of bananas. I love it. It's awesome. And I eat probably about m half of those hundreds. So when people come out, you make a stop, and I guess you're just serving up all kinds of banana dishes. What else do we have? Uh, we're going to be doing uh, banana smoothies today, today as well. So we've got chocolate monkey smoothies. It's banana. It's, uh, it, it's coconut. It's honey and it's chocolate almond breeze blue diamond almond breeze so we're going to be doing that today as well as coconut uh banana smoothies over here we got the uh, coconut blue diamond almond breeze as well as bananas pineapples oh man it's going to be good do you have a favorite banana dish recipe drink uh man i'll tell you what there is nothing like a coconut Blue Diamond Almond Breeze Banana Smoothie on a hot summer day. You know, coconut milk is water-based, so you can have a delicious, fresh uh, banana smoothie every day of the week, and I, I just love it. I mean, it's, it's super nice. I mean, it's hot out here on the tour. It's hot out here in Virginia, and so, you know, sometimes, you know, you need to sneak a treat yourself, and so I, that's what I do. I treat myself as well as all the people here. And is there a, like, most surprising banana fact than folks are learning when they're stopping by and learning about dull bananas and peeling the love is yeah. it the grilling well i mean you know bananas are nature's energy bar i mean you can have you can have a banana any day anytime you can have them for breakfast you can have them for lunch you can have them for dinner they're in 90 percent of all the households and on this peel the love tour we're going to go for 93 percent oh my gosh that sounds so exciting and you know what i usually think about eating bananas to to wrap up my my leg cramps that's right. But, uh, I like all these bananas. High, high in potassium, oh. you know. It's I love it. So we're going bananas. We're peeling the love. Dole.com slash peel the love. That's where you can find us. We're going to be all across the country. We look forward to seeing you. All right, we're going bananas. Back to you. All right. Okay. And send it over to you guys in the kitchen. <laughs> I'm back in the kitchen with uh, <laughs> Chef Troy Camacho uh, from the Culinary Institute of Virginia. He's here to show us that you can have bananas for dinner. Absolutely. Bananas for dinner, you got to have it. It's good, nutritious. But if you look at it, look what we got out here. Dole hooked us up today on their, on their tour. So look, you got, you got this beautiful 
uh, almond milk okay. with coconut. Okay. We got bananas. We got pineapple. We got fruits. We got chicken. We got everything. I'm in Fat Boy Heaven right now. Yeah, fat Boy. Hey, <laughs> sounds like Fat Boy Heaven. But this is healthy right it's, here. It's actually healthy though. It is. Look what we got here. So, from Dole, they have their actual uh, leafy uh, uh, romaine. Okay. So we're gonna do two two things today. One is we're gonna do an actual uh, Thai noodle and chicken salad with a uh, a peanut sauce. Sounds great. Uh, I just said that because you're actually going to do I'm, it. I'm putting it together. You're putting it together. I'm putting it together. And the other one we're going to do is actually a, uh, a little kebab. I actually did it here. A little, little, little piece we threw together for you here. I was going to taste it. Anyway. Yeah, you got to taste it. <laughs> <laughs> we did this here. This actually kebab here has actually got bananas. Got the, uh, it's more of a uh, Caribbean style. Okay. Right. So this is actually very, very nice. Uh, we'll talk about that. So you got, got a Jamaican mix on it. So let's put it together. Let's do it. All right. You want to do this? Let's do it. Let's check it out. So we got is... I already put the romaine in here for you. Okay. Uh, I know it's your first time with me on here, so with Chris, I try to make it simple. Okay. I'm going to keep it simple with you, Let's too. Let's do it. Let's put it together. So we got here, if we look at what we got ingredient-wise. We got some thin-cut red onions. Let's go and put those on there. Okay, so the banana goes last since they're the headline. That's what it is. Okay. They got to okay. see it. Okay. No, don't I'm, be scared. Look at don't that. be scared. Don't be scared. Okay, I got I'm all jumping cut in. For you. Okay. All right. Now, the beautiful part, let's go with some, what are these? Cucumbers. Cucumbers. You got to have them. I'm a country boy. I know my I know my vegetables. Okay, we do we doing all of them. We are doing all of them. Okay. I ain't scared either. Okay. Scared? Okay. I'm never scared. There's what I'm talking about. I'm never scared. All right. So now we got these two out of the way. What we got? I could have saw some nice my favorite, chicken. My favorite. You like that my favorite. Chicken? My favorite. And you can throw that on there. My favorite. Just throw it. Look on. at that. Okay. There we go. End of the day. Guess what? It's gonna look pretty, right? I'm gonna eat it at the end of the day. You know. So let's do a little layer here. Let's do a little bit of this peanut sauce. Peanut sauce. Now on the uh, on the website, it's on the Dole website. Go, go. So how do I, is it kind of like all the way Just across? Oh, look at that. No, I yeah. want it to look pretty. That's what I like when I go to the restaurant. I like mine to look pretty. Look, you can't make it look prettier than you, though. You know, right? Yeah, it would never do that. No one do that. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we get that one out of the way. So now what do we got? We got a little peanuts. We'll finish with that. Bananas. Finish, let's throw finish bananas. with the, oh, throw the bananas, bananas on. on there. Bananas are the headliner. They are the headliner. Let's, Let's top it with some nice little peanuts here. Okay, I feel like I'm making a banana split or something. Okay. Oh, you know. No, this is this is nice right here. Okay, no, there you go. Look at that. Now, do I no, shake it no, up? No, or? no, you shake this up, you're gonna destroy it. Actually, uh -huh. what we do, we have our tongs right here. <laughs> I thought it was a toss out. No, it's all good. Toss it up. I thought it was. A now, all we gonna do with this is actually let it rest for a minute. Okay. Come back a little bit more sauce on top of it, just uh -huh. a little more, just to finish it off. This is really thick. It's really thick. It looks good though. It smells good too. Mm hmm. Taste that. Mm. That's what I'm saying. Not bad. bad. Not bad. Not bad for not a rookie bad, on this not side. Bad, but this so we'll come back to this. Now this. This is what I was looking. Uh, I know you're looking at. That's it. what I had my eye on right there. I look a lot of times. We actually do two <laughs> things here. One, you go to the store and you actually find these little kebab kind of things, right? Little okay. skewers. Uh, make sure if you're going to use these, soak them. Get them. Get them super super wet. Or go to a nice store and do this right here. Look at this. Oh. I like this. Go get these metal rods because then these actually work nice. You see right here, they actually, once these heat up, they cook from the outside also. Heat uh -huh. up and they cool down, you can use them, get a little more room. If for those people who live in apartments and don't have a grill outside, it's okay. You put what it about right me? I have it. an apartment with a fancy grill outside. Then you can do it here. <laughs> put it on here, put it on the grill and cook it off. Oh, okay. Oh, so, thank you. I should tell you to do it. Okay. So we got, so you see our ingredients here, so let's go with. This is actually a Caribbean mix. Why not grab a Caribbean? I mean, this is Jamaican jer jerk. Uh, marinade. Okay. Easy to do. Pour it in there, and we put it together. All we gotta do is here's the wrap. Here's what we got. Got shrimp. Let it marinate it. Skewer it, and there it is. Stop by the cabana, ban banana cabana <laughs> for the peel the love for yourself. You can find it at the Oceana Naval Commissary in Virginia Beach today until 2 p.m. And in case you missed it, log on to dole.com backslash peel the love for great recipes, ideas, and more. Thank you. Thank you, Thank Troy. You. Hey, Thank right. you, bro. All right.